25 factorial means 25 into 24 into 23 until 1. So of course there would be a 13 somewhere, there would be a 2 somewhere. So 26 is going to be a factor of 25. So this statement is false. 29 is a factor of 25. 29 is a prime number greater than 25. So of course this is not going to lie anywhere in this product. Therefore, no, 29 is not a factor of 25. This statement is also incorrect. Look at the last one. This is 1 million 10 raised to power 6. Don't take it as 10 raised to power 6. Take it as 2 raised to power 6 into 5 raised to power 6. When you expand 25 factorial, Intuitively, you can see 2 raised to power 6 will not be a problem. 8 itself has 3 2's in it. 16 has 2 raised to power 4 in it. So 6 2's is never going to be a problem. It's about 5 raised to power 6. So see, 5, 10, 15, 20, they would each have 1 5 in it. So they would leave a 5 raised to power 4 and 25 has two fives in it, five raised to power two. This is a very important concept, the concept of highest power of a prime number. In case you're not familiar with this concept, please watch our video straight forward to find the number of fives in 25 factorial. We say 25 upon five, five, and then five upon five, one more. They're going to be six fives and therefore as many tenths in 25 factorial. Here I've done it quite simply. It was a small number I could actually practically count. These four have one fives, 25 has two. So they're going to be six fives and therefore one million is going to be a factor of 25 factorial. The right answer choice here is option B.